I'm going to be making a really simple uh, dirty rice. I'm going to show you real quick how this is done. Onion, bell pepper, green onion, and garlic. You know, just it's, it's a staple. I always use it. Now, if I'm going to do gumbo or a chicken dish, I'll add um, celery. But for anything else, I don't like celery, especially in my rice and pasta dishes. For me, to me, it takes the flavor away. We're going to add some Richard dressing mix to this recipe, along with roll sausage. And this is Tennessee Pride, and it's one pound. So I've already sauteed this. I'm going to add these two ingredients to that. Here what I'm doing, I'm adding the rest of that to that, so not side the same. And here's the recharge salad for dressing mix. Now in here you have pork, chicken gizzards, water, onion, chicken broth, bell pepper, celery, and there's a roux already in there, and it has other spices and other ingredients, but these are the first ingredients, so it's more that than anything else. And all you do is mix these items together. Uh, when it's com thoroughly combined, you're going to add your seasonings to it. And right now I'm also boiling two cups of rice. And you're going to add that to it with your seasonings, and that's your dirty rice. That's your quick version. Now, you can make it from scratch. Like I told you before, everything that you make with these products, you can also make from scratch. Now, even if I do it from scratch, I still like the flavor of the... Um, the prepared sausage, pork sausage. If you can find the brine pampered sausage, it is absolutely the best. Now, sometimes when I fix this, I'll add uh, pureed, I'll add pureed, um, what I do, I'll boil my chicken liver down to, to you know, to it's almost, it almost has a broth in it, and I take it in a blender, and I puree it, and I add a little bit of that to it. But a lot of people don't like the flavor of the liver. Using liver, your it, it, it will actually fall fast. Now here, what you want to do is, because you have that, you know, that rolled pan sausage, as you're cooking it, you're cooking it, you don't want big chunks of the sausage. So as it's cooking, you want to just mash it down. I don't want big chunks of, uh, like, sausage patties in here. We want to just mash that down. See, like that big piece there? You still going to have some little chunks, but not go real, real big you want to crumble it up now as it's cooking. This is one of those dishes I told you, green onion, really enhances the flavor. Okay, when I come back, I'll show you uh, when it's completely done. I'm just cooking it now. Um, and when this is ready, we'll add our two cups of... Uh, it was two cups of dried rice that I've actually boiled. And then we'll add that to this. And then once we add that rice, we'll go in and we'll season it to your liking, whatever seasons you prefer. I'll show you the ones I use, but you may have another preference. Now, one thing I found that some people fix dirty rice and it's extra dry. If you ever fix a rice dish or a pasta dish and it's dry like that, just add your little chicken broth to it or um, beef broth, but I would prefer chicken broth in mine. I don't like the beef broth because I think that takes away from the flavor, but whatever is your preference. And some people add Worcestershire sauce to this. I don't. I don't like the way it alters the taste. But if, you know, if you try it and if you like it, that's what you do. I'll be back. Sweet. Hold on. Okay, here is the completed 
seasoning combined. I've mixed. I've added seasonings to it, and it is done. Now all we have to do is add our two cups of rice that we boiled. Whatever is your preference, I like batterings or Uncle Ben. We mix it up. We thoroughly combine it. We seated our church the second Saturday of the month. Had a lot of good reviews on this the rice the way I fix it. Okay, so it's combined, it's thoroughly combined now. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to taste it to see what kind of seasonings it needs to have. Can I have a little more? More Creole season. Now you're tummy. There's some more garlic powder. This is a new one I just got to be at Sam's. Now, it's a little drier than what I like mine. I'm going to see how it cooks for a while, if maybe, you know, maybe get a little better. But I think the recharge, if I can remember, is a little drier. And so far, it's in my rice. I think I may have overcooked my rice. But anyway, this is what it looks like. 